This is the Chad Coomer. He's a Chad, but he also cooms a lot. He's a really, really cool guy. He's doing his thing. Maybe some of you will relate to him. We're learning all about him today. We're also learning about the V-Card, no fapper, and of course, our mystery man over here. Just you wait till you find out who he is. That'll be later on in the video. But before we begin, I just want to remind you that no matter which of these characters you relate to, it's okay, because we're all going to make it okay. And if you agree with me on that fact, please hit that thumbs up to let everyone else know we're all going to make it, okay? With that having been said, let's begin. So we've got the V-Card no fapper here. All right, look at him. That boy looks like he's doing his thing. Apparently, he has a receding hairline, combs it back instead of doing a comb over, making it look 10 times worse. Hey, whenever that hair starts falling out, babe, we gotta start rocking that shaved head look, all right? Sometimes we gotta start rocking it. And if you may say, Bass Shaman, I look weird if I don't have any hair. All you gotta do is put on some muscle, all right? Once you put on some muscle, you will rock this bald head like you've got so much swag, all right? Don't be worried about all that crap, okay? Let's cut it off, babe. It's constantly sad. Oh, sad. A lot of sadness out there, hell yeah. A lot of sadness, right? Sometimes we just need to find something to replace that sadness with. It's gonna be okay. Maybe say V-card, no fat. It's gonna be okay. You keep pushing, babe. We're gonna find something to replace that sorrow with, okay? Hell yeah. He goes to therapy because he actually thinks it will help. Hey, therapy can definitely help, all right? Never be afraid of therapy, babe. There's so many stories of folks who have been greatly helped by therapy. I know some who have too. Don't be afraid of that, all right? It can help, babe. But only if you believe it's possible, all right? It's gonna be okay, my V-card friend. We gonna do it. It says he has zero friends outside of Reddit. Hey, that's okay, babe. That's okay. Because you know what? Your friends on Reddit, like, they are your friends, babe. If they care about you, right? What makes a friend? A friend is someone who cares about you, right? And as long as they care about you, they're your friend, all right? Even if they're on Reddit. He has a small... Oh, come on. He has a small schlong due to lack of use, as well as a, a high body fat percentage. You don't have a small schlong from lack of using it. <laughs> That's so silly. You ever heard that? You better use that schlong of yours or it's gonna shrink. <laughs> That's just because you have shit genetics, okay? That's a, no, 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 look, 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 look. It's not the size, mate, it's how you use it. You ever seen uh, Austin Powers? It's not the size, it's how you use it, all right? So what if you, it's a little smaller than other folks? As long as you know how to use it, that's all that matters, right? As long as you know how to hit those right spots, baby. Do that thing, you know what I mean, Jelly Bean? Have her, have her feeling right, baby. Give her that good pipe, you know? It's okay, all right? Don't you worry about that, okay? Man, as well as a high body fat percentage. Hey, whenever the body fat gets too high, babe, we can diet it down. We cut, all right? We cut, babe. I like to use keto when I gain a little too much body fat, babe. That keto, man, keto, it makes that body fat fall off, all right? But always consult your doctor beforehand because some folks don't respond well to it. Let's go, baby. Let's go. Thinks he's hot shit just because he doesn't fap. Hey, it's not easy not to fap, right? If he's able to do that, that takes some that takes some dedication, that takes some effort, that takes some resilience there. Resilience against the fap, you know? You start feeling, man, I think I wanna, okay, no, I'm not going to. I'm too strong for this. It's not gonna bring me down anymore. Hell yeah. He spent hundreds of dollars on Tim's, hates wearing them on his delicate feet and only does so because he thinks it will attract women. Hey, if you've got some nice shoes like some Timberlands, those can definitely be attractive to some women may see those and say, wow, look at his Timberlands. <laughs> Hell yeah. Say, I want a piece of that, you know? No, Timberland, you can look very good in those shoes. Don't you feel bad about buying them, okay? They're cool. Man, my heart goes out to my boy here because those are some cool shoes, man. He's doing his thing, all right? It says he is a Christian, you know? Hell yeah. Hey, if you want to be a Christian, babe, you be a Christian, all right? You know? You may have some folks saying some things about you. You may have folks calling you things, you know? That's on them, babe. If you want to be a Christian, you be a Christian, all right? I know it's 2020. I know you're kind of going to be a little target here and there, but do your thing, all right? Don't let anybody bring you down. You believe in what you choose to believe in, all right? Anybody got a problem with that? Tell them to catch some lockjaw and serve his daddy, all right? He wears glasses because he played too many video games during his formative years. Oh, wow. Too many video games during his formative years. Video games, babe. Hey, the thing about those video games is in those video games, you know, a lot of times you get to experience these uh, adventure, you know, that in, in IRL, you kind of don't get to experience so much, right? You get to be the hero. You get to defend, protect, fight, you know. We're gonna fight for our right to party. Dun, dun, dun. Thumbs up the video right now for that song. 
No, nah, babe, but the video games, babe, don't be feeling bad because you played that shit, all right? You played it, that's okay, right? No, I think the only time it's a problem is if it gets in the way of IRL. All right, if you say, in real life, I don't have the shit I want, but I'm spending a lot of time playing video games, then that's when I say, you know, I tell you, it can be very helpful to stop playing them and start focusing on real life, you know, real life. But what is real life? I guess real life is different for everybody. I think it's like getting to wherever the hell you want to go, accomplishing whatever you want, whatever you want, right? Take everybody else, baby. Just cut them all out and say, you say, what do you want, babe? What is it what you want in your life, right? Say, why can't you have it? Why can't you achieve that shit? Why can't you obtain it? You can't get it, baby. Sometimes we just got to cut every, all the other bullshit out, all right? Especially people who don't fucking align with that shit, baby, right? Take your path, baby. Take your path. I believe in you so much, fella. Takes antidepressants because he actually thinks they will help. Hey, those can help too, right? I guess it, every, every uh, situation's different, right? Uh, those can help depending on who you are, you know? Hell yeah. Don't be afraid, babe. Don't be afraid to try different things. We gotta find out what works for us, right? Hell yeah. Man, I've never I've never had any experience, so I don't know. I can't make any recommendations on anything like that. But I can say, babe, you know, well, sometimes we gotta try what works for us, right? Hell yeah. Hell yeah. He has absolutely no vigor or manliness. Has pipe cleaner arms and a flat ass as a result. Hell yeah. No, so no manliness, huh? He has got no pipe cleaner arms. I'll tell you what, babe. I'll tell you what, man. You know how we can, like, change that? If you want to change that, we could we could work out, babe. Work out, you know? Working out, man. That shit changed my life so much. And that's why I love to see others who use it to change their lives, too. Something so magical about building physical strength in yourself. And along with it comes confidence, you know? And along with it comes the respect of others, too. A lot of times, we kind of look at each other and kind of just automatically judge each other without thinking. And when people see that you're kind of a tough, you know, strong person they don't want to mess with, people treat you differently, you know? As opposed to them seeing you as weak. And uh, it makes your life different, you know? I know it would be a wonderful world if we didn't all judge each other, but <laughs> that's the way humanity's always been. It's always going to be, right? Take care of yourself, all right? And other people are going to treat you a little bit better, babe. But what's most important is the way you treat yourself, all right? Hell yeah. You ain't kidding. That's so beautiful. Please thumbs up this video right now. That's beautiful, man. He actually believes that mass that fapping has negative physical and mental effects despite every single piece of credible scientific evidence proving otherwise. Responds, okay, Coomer, to any legitimate counter-argument. Um... Mm. <laughs> Whoever made this, like, the whole thing is very satirical, isn't it? Because, like, like no, there's, there's a lot of science that backs that shit up, man. You know, like, whenever you stop doing that, it can have some great effects on you. Really great effects on you. <laughs> Whoever made this is funny as shit. Like, the things that they wrote here, this is really funny. <laughs> no, baby, look. If you want to stop fapping, you can do it. And you're going to see some great changes, all right? Hell yeah. You ain't kidding. Uh, he has weak knees. <laughs> he has weak knees. Uh, not much you can do there, right? I mean, you can't really strengthen your knees, can you? It's not really a muscle. It's a fucking bone, dude. I mean, but it also said he has a flat ass, right? So, we're gonna do some squats for that booty, baby. We're gonna get that shit poking, brother. Scratch car! And then maybe your maybe your knees will get a little stronger in the... I mean, the kneecap and shit, dude. That's like bones. That's like muscles. That's okay, though, babe. We're gonna work on that shit, okay? It says he dislikes geese and, and transgender people, yet he would never talk shit to them in person. Oh, yeah. Lots of folks like that out there, aren't there? Like... They have this shit against, like, gays and everything, but they would never talk shit to them in person, right? Uh, online they will, though. People will do that shit online, just not in person, because, you know, like, it's all, shits and, it's all shits and giggles until people see you, like, standing in front of them, right? Hell yeah. Maybe it would do folks good, though. Maybe if they actually meet, you know, someone who is gay or trans, like, they'll be like, you know what? <laughs> you know what? You're not so bad after all, <laughs> you know? Like, I don't know, but they probably won't meet them, though. They probably won't meet anybody, because, you know, everything's stuck online, you know? Hell yeah. I don't know, baby. I just don't know. Hell yeah. Let's go. Let's go. He goes on too many walks out of boredom. Says he does it for self-improvement reasons. W whatever that means. <laughs> no, it's good. You go on a walk, babe. Especially your night walks, okay? Don't be afraid to go on some night walks. You know what I mean, Jelly Bean? That's cool. No, I really like that. Very, very, very V-card, no fabric. Let's go on. We're going to check out the Chad. The Chad Coomer. This boy's cooming so hard, baby. He's cooming so hard. Hey, speaking of cooming and cooming really hard... Uh, I tell you what, my friends, uh, Christmas is coming up, holiday is coming up, right? And maybe you don't know what you're going to get for your loved ones. Maybe you don't know what you're going to get for yourselves. But I'll tell you what, baby, over on basechaman.com slash merch, we've got some awesome Coomer merch, baby. Like, this is some, like, where else can you find a big-ass shirt that says, I'm Cooming? Like, that's so cool. Of course, we've got all the, uh, the consumer merch, too, for those consumers in your life. 
just a Chad looking for my Stacy. We got so much cool shit, babe. We got Supreme Gentleman. Where else can you get like an all over print Supreme Gentleman? Like this is some cool shit, all right? Bayshopman.com slash merch. That's that plug, baby. What you know about that plug? Certified Doomer, Certified Stacy, Certified Chad, Certified Tyrone, and of course the original Chad shit too. We've got it all over there. Bayshopman.com slash merch. Link pinned in the, in the comments below. I'll put it in the description. I'll put that shit everywhere, babe. Let's learn about our boy, Chad Coomer. Coming hard on that ass, baby. He has messy hair. The hoes love it anyway. Hell yeah, baby. He's doing his thing, man. That's some messy hair, all right, right? He has perfect facial features. Oh, yeah, he does. Do perfect. Look at that jaw. I think my man's been mewing. He's probably been mewing very hard. Nice. Probably been chewing the phalum gum. Hell yeah. The phalum gum, baby. You got to chew the phalum gum, man. That's your, like, it works out your jaw. It's like a jaw. Let's go, baby. Has beautiful pale skin from spending his time indoors. <laughs> Hell yeah, babe. That Coomer, man, he's coming hard, staying inside, man. Hell yeah. His abs are on point. So abs on point because his diet's on point, right? It says he possesses a clean shaven uh, <laughs> piece that projects enormous amounts of the jazz. Enormous amounts. He's doing his thing, man. Well, he doesn't follow any cultish ideologies. I guess he's kind of coming up with his own shit, huh? Does not believe in religion. Due to how pointless and restrictive it is. Wow. It's his own person. Is always happy <laughs> and he's ready to get it on. Uh, muscles, man. He's got some good muscles. Wow. Probably from a lot from Kuming, huh? Wow. Says he watches the... Wow. He, uh, he, he plays with himself multiple times per day. It says he gets laid anyways. Because those two things have absolutely nothing to do with each other. It says he loves the gays. And he proudly hooks up with them. He's doing his thing, babe. I'll tell you what, Chad Coomer, baby, he don't discriminate, does he? Wow. Has indestructible feet from foot fisting his many partners on numerous occasions. It says he doesn't even need shoes. <laughs> Dude, this is one of the strangest ch uh, Chads that we've ever seen. All right, where's our mystery man at? Where's our mystery man at? Here we go. Here he is. Look at this boy ain't kidding. This is the, the thad normal human being. It says he faps maybe once every day or two. I don't know. He doesn't make a big deal about it. Dude, look at this guy's... Look at this guy's muscles, dude. Holy... No homo breast. Skr, skr. Dude, look at that guy's muscles. Holy shit. Damn, dude, this guy's not kidding. Nobody cares what he does behind closed doors. Is successful and has plenty of friends as well as perfect health and didn't even realize that no fap was a thing. That's right, babe. He's a normal... <laughs> the fad normal human being. He's doing his thing, man. I'll tell you what. You want to become a thad? I'm going to tell you exactly how to do it right now, okay? I want you to bow your heads right now, okay? And I want you to say this in your head. I you say, you know what? I'm a thad, all right? I don't care if people calling me a, you know, Chad Coomer, a V-card, no fapper. I'm a thad, all right? And in order to secure my place as a thad, I'm going to click this video that just popped up on the screen. Go to Base Shaman's next video. I'm going to love it. I can't wait to see it. It's going to be so good. I'm clicking it right now because I'm a thad, okay? Hell yeah.